Hey everybody, welcome back to Christmas Decor. Today we're gonna to start on our Easter spring wreath. So I have Alexis here to help me. We're gonna show you what we purchased. So you're gonna get your metal wire wreath at the dollar store. They're selling out pretty quickly, so hopefully you can get some. If not, go to any craft store. Um, so what we picked up is some tools. They had these uh, bright colors at Dollar Tree for a dollar, so I got four packs of them. So I'm not sure how many I'm gonna use for this. And we got some cute little carrots. And we have some shimmery eggs. All at Dollar Tree. And there's gold, pink, green, and pink. And there's a bunch. And then you're gonna get some pipe cleaners. And you're gonna cut them into three. So uh, Alexis helped me cut up the tool um, and I started to do some of the twisting to save some time. So we did um, two rolls of tool and what you're going to do is just cut it into little sections like this. You're going to roll it up and use the pipe cleaner. And then we're going to create our wreath and then we're going to use the decor that we bought to glue it on. You can roll it back and forth, or you could twist the diagonal. Everybody has their different way of doing it. Um, whatever mm -hmm. goes with the flow, you're just gonna fill up your wreath and then we'll decorate. And if you're and new to my it. channel, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you can see the next video coming up. And like. And Alexis has her YouTube channel too for your kids. It's called Lexi Poo. So you want to check out her channel, give her a little shout out. She's got some cool stuff going on. So now you're going to take your tool and you're just going to start using the pipe cleaners, throughout the name, and just <laughs> twist them around to secure them. And you just want to work your way from inside to out, like this, and fill up the whole thing. And then once you have it, you can see if you need to um, add any more to make it fuller and then we're going to start gluing on the decor. Here's the finished product of the wreath. Now we're going to decorate it. I definitely suggest um, going to like a Walmart or a fabric store. The one from the dollar store is a little bit see-through. Um, it filled it up nicely but I like it not to be able to see the wire. So it's so cute but we're going to fill it up now. So now that we're done the wreath, we're going to move on to a simple candy Easter bouquet. So you could get these little boxes, um, Walmart or the Dollar Tree, and you want to get a piece of styrofoam and place it in there. You want to get your candy sticks. I get these at Walmart. Um, the little snack size candies for a dollar. I got four. And then the Dollar Tree had these cute little eggs along with the bunnies. So we're going to create the bouquet, oh, and then some roses, I thought these were really pretty. So simple, get your wooden sticks out, you're going to do three um, candies per stick, and once we have them all glued, we're going to set up and decorate. Alright, let's get to it. So you want to take your centerpiece and put that in the middle to start with so that you can put everything else around it.
So here's how it looks. And then I'm gonna grab some tissue paper. And quickly put some tissue paper in the back side of it to kind of fill it up. Make it look fuller and so you don't see all the styrofoam and holes, open holes. piece of it to the back and push it in so that it stays for me. Alright, so here you have it. This is the simple, easy Easter bouquet of candy and decor. I hope you liked the video. Please make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel and hit those notification buttons. I hope you guys have a great day and check in next time. Take care.